Thanks for joining us on Backwoods Pursuit. Today I'm going to show you how to calculate your arrow FOC or your arrow front of center. There's a lot of different schools of thought as far as what you want to aim for as far as your FOC on your arrows, especially FOC on hunting arrows. But uh, I'll leave that up to you. I'm just going to show you how to calculate your arrow FOC in this video. I personally like to shoot for as high of an FOC as I can. I like that, that weight out on the end of the arrow to guide the, the shaft of the arrow rather than having the weight in the shaft pushing the, the tip of the arrow. That's just my personal preference, but there's a, there's a process here to, to figure out how to calculate the, the FOC. Now there are some online calculators as far as, I think Gold Tip has a website where you can punch in the, the shaft, the grains per inch, that sort of thing. Uh, the, the weight of the knock and the, the fletchings and all that and that gets you in the ballpark but doing it manually like this is a much more accurate process to determine exactly what your specific arrow FOC is with the hunting tip or the broadhead that you are using so I'll show you how to do that it's quick and easy as always sure would appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button for us and follow us on Facebook and Instagram and our website backwoodspursuit.com let's go get started Okay, so the first step in this process is we got to get the total length of the arrow. And by total length, it's the throat of the knock, right there where the, where the string locks in. The throat of the knock to the end of your shaft there, including the insert. So first thing I'm going to do here is go ahead and measure this. Okay, so we are measuring this arrow from the throat of the knock to the end of the insert is 28 and a half inches. So that is the, the total length of the arrow. That's the first piece of calculating the FOC that you need to know. So once you've got that, uh, we're gonna go ahead and put the, the, the hunting tip that you're going to be using, or if you're just gonna use this for, uh, for target archery, that sort of thing, put up whatever tip you're gonna be using on there. In this case, I'm going to calculate the FOC with the uh, Annihilator broadhead and see what we come up with. Now, this is a Black Eagle Rampage arrow. I've got a, a footer on here that's about 12 grains as well as a 75 grain hit insert. And this is a 125 grain tip. So I'm trying to get a higher FOC if possible on this. Once you've got your tip selected and put on your arrow, you find a, a, a sharp edge somewhere where you can try to balance the arrow. And then we're gonna use a piece of chalk or something that you can mark where that balancing point is and mark that for the next measurement. So, all right, so I've got my arrow assembled here. I'm gonna go ahead and, and find the balance point on this uh, the sharp edge here. Of, this is my bow vise. You can find any sharp edge that'll work and I'm gonna find the point here where this arrow balances without any assistance. I'll find that and then mark it with this chalk. Okay, so I went ahead and marked the balancing point right there and I'm gonna come and take another measurement now. Okay, so we've got the measurement here. We marked on the arrow shaft where uh, that, that balance point is. I'm gonna measure from that balance point to the throat of the knock, and that is 19 point, well, 19 and three quarters. Okay, so now that we've got the length of the arrow as well as the balance point marked on that arrow, I'm gonna grab, uh, you can either go to your computer, or grab your phone, whatnot. The one that I like to use that's easiest is uh, archerycalculator.com. There's other ones out there, but basically, it just uh, gives you some different points on here where you can go ahead and input those, those uh, measurements that we just took. So measured that, we're at 19.75 is our is our balance point. I'm going to put that, that information in. So the shaft length of, of 28.5, the arrow shaft length, and then the, the measurement as far as from that balance point to the throw of the knock is 19.75. And my FOC on this arrow is 19.298. I mean, you can see that or not. But that's the calculation. As you can see here, it, it walks you through those steps for yourself. It's kind of helpful, but you can see 28.5 inches as far as the, the total length. 19.75 is where that balance point was, giving me the FOC of 19.298 and then a bunch more decimal points there. I, I shoot for over 19% on my arrows. That's what I like. I know that's pretty high, but I was able to accomplish it with this setup because of the light shaft 
uh, 8.7 inches uh, grains per inch on this 300 uh, rampage shaft um, and has kept the, the total weight at about 492 grains. So still a heavy arrow, but not super heavy to where you're gonna be lobbing the arrows too badly. So I was able to accomplish what I wanted with this arrow build, and that, that's how you calculate your FOC for your own. Um, so you can, can uh, take that into account when you're building your arrows. Thanks for joining us today, sure appreciate it, and we'll see you next time. <laughs>